Kelly Slater. Yesterday he won his 11th ASP, but he can't touch Garrett McNamara. For what seems to be the biggest wave ever surfed, as high as 100 feet. That tiny dot is Garrett McNamara. He's a professional daredevil. He holds the record for surfing the world's biggest wave. Look how big that thing is. Absolutely ridiculous. I think I'd call that crazy. Uh, that would be pretty nuts. <laughs> Congratulations. I mean, the photo of you on that wave is, is unbelievable. How did it feel? What was the ride like? It takes most guys 10 years to do what Garrett did in one year. It takes most guys 20 years to do what he did in three to five years. Pretty much set the standard and did some game-changing things in the sport. We get to wake up every morning to think about where we're going to go surf. It's just, I mean, it's a dream come true every day. I'm so grateful that I get to do this for a living. A gnarly wipeout in Half Moon Bay. McNamara falls off his surfboard and hits the water three times. Like a stone skipping across mm -hmm. the water there. If you don't have a deltoid, you don't have a shoulder. And he's not going to be surfing at all. And you took all the screws out? No? You should not surf those waves, no matter how much you enjoy. to do this like five times a day. Every day you wake up with purpose and direction. You know what you're doing. And anything that you do that isn't a part of this, you're getting further away from doing what you love.